<sighs> yeah, we were supposed to leave an hour ago, but it's all right. We're on our way now. Got Big Bertha. Never had her out in the hills. And we have Baby Ruth. Another new mule we never had in the hills. So it's probably going to be an interesting day. <coughs> we got a... Down south here, they, let, they bred 22 antelope and let them go last week, a couple weeks ago. Um, when they put the antelope in the pen to breed, the next day they had a lion come circling around. So, and then a week later, the lion came back. I think what happened is they have a, and I know this for a fact because I went and walked around that pen with my dogs, and the, uh, they have electric wire around that pen, and it's pretty hard. My dog is, uh, found out real quick what an electric fence is and I kind of got a little crappy the rest of the day because I thought I was shocking him. <clears throat> so I'm thinking that lion hit that fence and it deterred him a little bit. So we'll see what happens. See if uh, I've been out there a few times just driving trying to pick up a track and we picked up a track west of it. Oh, another story. Uh, maybe three weeks before they dumped those antelope, they had a black powder lion hunter or a black powder deer hunter over there. And uh, 100 yards, seen the lion, shot, missed. So, and I uh, found a track just about a mile. That was three miles west of that antelope pin uh, we found a track about a mile to the west <clears throat> but it was they didn't want to work it they did a little bit but that was it so today we're going to go in and do big circles on new mules and a few puppies so rodeo time i guess i'll uh try to get as much video as i can like i said i'm not good at this video thing um I'm starting this anecdote of a houndsman. If any of you know, anecdote just means story. <clears throat> so, I'm going to try to get some content up on YouTube as much as I can. Um, and I want to kind of do some interviews with people. Not just, I, I don't want famous people. Everybody knows who Warren Glenn is and, you know... <clears throat> all these big guys in New Mexico, Southern Arizona. Um, I want to find these basic amateurs or people who've been doing it a while and nobody knows who they are. So, um, do a couple interviews, puppy training stories, just an anecdote of a houndsman. That's all I'm shooting for. So, we'll see how it goes. I'm not real good at remembering to record. I guess I should have recorded saddling up. I'm not as good as Brett Vaughn. I gotta record to everything. I got one GoPro in my phone. And probably be pretty uh, slim pickings on what I put on the, uh, my YouTube page. So uh, stay tuned, huh? See what happens. Lion. A lot of deer 
up there. Yeah, this is where they had the antelope. We'll keep on plugging. See if we can't find them. I'm gonna check this water. See if uh, any tracks around it. Antelope, lion, deer, whatever. See what they're doing. Comes the sun. They left the water here for the uh, antelope <clears throat> for a while. Tore down their fence though. Hmm. Oh, I got a couple light tracks. I don't know what it is. <clears throat> it's after it rained, so just can't get a full set. And the little toes look like a lion, but I don't know. Looks like we'll go west a little bit. See if we can pick anything up. Beautiful day. Beautiful day to hunt a lion. Even if you're not good at it. Well, he stopped and checked that water for, that the BLM had for the antelope. Still there. Don't look like they've came in too much. Not for a little bit. Head, uh, head west here. Mile or two and see if we can't pick up some tracks or anything. Onward. Bunch of mutts. What is it? It's Eva. Eva. Come on. Yucky. Yucky. Yeah, he's taller than you thought, huh? Yeah. You might you might want to pull over to that uh fender there. Oh shit. Fuck been a while since you've been on a big horse, huh? Yeah. <laughs>
Lucky lock. Didn't go how we planned. The dogs did whatever they wanted to do, and we had to chase them for a few miles, find out what they was chasing. So, had some pups, a couple trashy dogs. Maybe next time, huh? Good exercise for the dogs and the mules. Mules did all right. Didn't get bucked off. Let's see what happens next time.